Mrs. Foster, what was the first thing that you saw? Well, I heard before I saw anything. I was standing right here in my kitchen preparing dinner, and my two boys came out the back door down the steps to get their bicycles. They got down to the bottom of the steps here, and they started screaming. They, we heard this terrible boom, and my boys looked around and saw the bridge starting to fall. Well, as soon as I heard the sound, I, of course, ran out the back door to see what was wrong with the boys and what the noise was. And as I got out my back door, of course, I could see what was happening, and I just, I stood right here and watched the whole bridge. What did the bridge look like? Well, it's like my little boy said, it was just like you would build um, a bridge out of child's building toys, and then if you just take a stick and just knock the props out from under it, that's the way it went. Did you see all the trucks and cars falling? I could see part of them, yes, uh, from where I'm standing, but of course, where the trees and things are, I couldn't see too much. Mr. Ellis, when was the first indication you had that everything was all wrong? Well, I came to myself after, I imagine it was after the truck came to rest at, on the shore there or on the ground. There was someone was trying to get me out. That's all I can remember. See, I was in the sleeper. Were you asleep at the time the bridge fell? Yes, sir, I was. And uh, what was the first thing you realized after the collapse? I realized someone was either pulling me out of the truck cab or lifting me onto a stretcher or something like that. I, I was so rattled, I was trying to figure out, but I couldn't. I believe they was lifting me onto a stretcher. What happened to the man who was driving the truck? Uh, he's just across the room here. He has a broken back, and uh, I'm not sure, but maybe one or two, or both of his legs broke. The man who was in the truck with you, have you spoken to him since? Oh, yes, sir. Uh, he uh, keeps him under sedation because he has quite a bit of pain. But he comes too, and we talk a little bit occasionally. Ever have an accident like this or anything like this before? Not this serious, no. This is the worst I've seen.